Alright guys, welcome back, first video on the channel for a few weeks, um, I've been working so I haven't had time to do anything, um, we've done a few streams but that's it, um, so the last video on the channel was Gold Rush, um, it's improved quite a lot since, since that like day one video that we did or day two or whatever it was um, so we'll probably get to another video on gold rush soon but today we're here with mud runner a spin tires game um, it's by saber interactive or something and then published by focus house interactive who is the same people that publish farm sim um, if you already own this game on Steam, I think you might still get it half price, but it was it was it was cheaper if you own the original game anyway. And it's on Xbox One and PS4 as far as I'm aware as well. Um, so I've played this for a few hours now, like six hours or something on stream. Uh, go over to Twitch TV slash Ramptumart4. I'll be able to see the VODs from that. Might import them over to YouTube, we'll see. But anyway, um, screen, like the layout and stuff is pretty much the same as last time. Like the layout's changed a little bit, but s same style if you get what I mean. For your menu, um, I've not tried it with a controller yet. Um, then you've got your settings, your controls. Um, wheel and controller support apparently um, so this is where it gets um, got tutorial we won't do that um, multiplayer same as the first one um, for four person multiplayer um, well this is where it gets a little bit interesting there's challenges there's only six of them no not six nine nine challenges um, and they're rather fun we did these on stream the last couple of days and it's and it's like it's pretty darn decent this one is rather hard though it took took a while or well, 26 minutes just to complete two bits of the thing um, so yeah it's a nice addition hopefully they add more challenges and stuff um, and then you've got the single player um where you can change you can manage your mods um you can choose vehicles that go in um i don't know if clicking on this is going to change so there's the all the vehicles that you can you have to unlock some of them But it's pretty much the same as the last game, like the biggest stuff. Um, and some of these are new. And there's a car as well. That's some... There is a car somewhere as well. Uh, hopefully that's not going to have changed the, changed the, the thing. Um, so yeah, we've already done the first one, completed game balance on casual. Um oh. Will it let us continue Bob? Oh we might have screwed it boys, we might have screwed it. Yeah, it won't let me continue. We've lost our save game. Oh um We'll just jump into bog again. Well, we've completed it anyway, so it's not really the end of the world. So you've got pretty much the same as the last game. Um, you can choose all the different things. I know where everything is now, so what we'll do is... Press V to 
go into the advanced mode, change truck, click on the old Jeep over here, uh, we'll just leave it standard. Oh no, we'll put a wheel on the back, there we go. <coughs> so, there is now in, in cab view, which is pretty useful. We've got a handbrake on. Um, it's pretty much the same, but the graphics is a lot better. The water, the water is a lot better. Well, the water was good in the first one, but the water on this one now is darn decent. The only gripe still is the camera is a little bit still crazy like the first one. It takes a while to get used to. But yeah, we've it's all covered over still but what we'll do is we'll just drive down here and get one of these other one of these other bit one of these other trucks see the the in cab view is pretty all right but there's no mirrors and one of the challenges is um reverse right let's get it out of there so you can see this more The water's looking rather good. My sound like I only use one headset. So like sometimes it goes really quiet for me, but let's go power on. Like the light the lighting in the game has been improved according to the according to the thing. Oops, got to get the camera angle can be a pain to get, to get the camera angle you want. You've got your automatic gears, what we're in now, or you've got, you can select, let us into it. So you've got like, the slow first, slightly better first, like a crawler gear, and then normal first, and then you've got like first plus one that you can stall trying to get it into, and then your reverse as well has got a couple of extra, a couple of extra gears, like. There's free reverse settings, so when you get proper stuff, you can just fire them on, and away you go. But yeah, the camera's still, I don't know what it's like on console, but the camera on. The camera on. And the PC is a little bit crazy still, but at least there's now the in, in cab view. gonna get through I think this is where the other two trucks were but yeah so far it's like it's a nice improvement the first when the first game came out like they fixed it a little bit and then left it so but this this seems to be running pretty darn sweet I've not had any issues yet um, So we'll jump in this bad boy and take it for a little, a little fire off. But yeah, so far, very impressed. Um, we'll probably change. We can change it to to day and night in a second. Oh, don't forget you've got your winch, um, so you can pull yourself. Um, you can pull stuff out with the drive mode or the pull mode, so you can just pull it towards you. Or you can drive mode, so pretty much you can press V again and then S. 
Oh, we've not got any autos. No automatic. But yeah, it's pretty darn. We can winch. Right, we need to change. Change vehicle. And this thing is a beast. You've got headlights, which is H. The lighting. Let's see if we can Let's take the handbrake off. You never turn the other one off. This has got. Gets, you can get damage on it. It's got a little bit of fuel you can see there when you zoom in close you can see the fuel on the old girl. Right, let's see if we can switch it to night. Skip night. No. Oh, it's only skip night. We can't turn it to night. So we might not get to see in this video the um Why not get to see the night time? It's walled instead, so we're gonna get stuck. I think it's 11.35 in the game right now. So that's the damage that we've done to it. There's the river there. <coughs> now this water... When you go in it with a dirty truck and stuff, it makes the water go all brown as well you can see it around the around the truck it's going all dirty which is a pretty nice little graphic but yeah the lighting is a lot nicer now uh, we need to maybe that gear will get us out nope it's spinning too much so we need to knock it down into there we go we probably just should winch out shouldn't we let's just winch out there we go we're free we're free some of the trees that you winch on, you can actually pull them over, it's pretty funny. So it's not gonna, we're not gonna get to see the old night time. But it's rather beautiful. Um, so definitely worth picking up. I've not tried the multiplayer yet. I never got around to playing the multiplayer in the first one, but we should give it a go at some point. So when you get your truck wet, it goes up. The colour will change and stuff. It's pretty sweet. I'm probably just going to get it stuck now because we're in just in full power mode. But you can see the water changing around and stuff. It's pretty, pretty darn cool. So what we'll do is we'll probably end the video there, boys and girls. Um, I'll put a link in the description um, for the website and the Steam link, if I can remember to get the Steam link. I'll definitely put the website link in. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out the Facebook, the Twitter, Discord, and come through to the Twitch streams. And say what's up. Um, be on Twitch whenever we can, like whenever I get time. Um, Twitch TV slash Ramp Team Up Four. Um, we've got affiliate with Twitch, so you can use your Amazon. Prime sub or just sub normally. Um, you should get encoding as well and um, bits, etc. So we get all the good stuff over Twitch Partner, which is sweet. Um, we'll be on with Farm Sim, Mud Runner, and some Gold Rush when we can. So yeah, check it out. I'll put a link in the description. Um, Pass VODs for spin tyres, let me know if you want me to import them over to YouTube, it shouldn't be a problem. 
But yeah, this game overall is very good. If you like getting stuck in mud, it's a definite, definite worth, worth buying. So thanks for watching, and I shall see you in the next video.